All right, so now that we've talked about profit maximizers and, and the role that they play in just frankly making you a whole lot more money from the uh, sales that you already have, let's go back and revisit the formula for business growth. If you recall, it's leads times customers times profit margin times frequency equals growth potential. So the way that we increase the growth potential of our business is by optimizing all of these elements by pulling all of these four levers by cranking them up just a little bit more. And we already did that when we optimized the lead magnet. Remember by, by optimizing lead magnet, we hopefully were able to double the number of leads that we had coming in. And, and, and then we were able to, to double the number of customers first, just by getting crystal clear on what does our market want and speaking to that, speaking to that thing that they want through the statement of value between that and the tripwire, doubling your conversion rate, getting more, uh, you know, getting a whole lot more customers, that's very, very doable. So we doubled the leads, doubled the customers. Our growth potential is now four times larger than it once was. But check this out. By doubling our margin, we're able to double that again up to eight. So you may be wondering, how does doubling your margin, how does increasing your profit, I see how it makes me more money, but how does it increase the growth potential? And the answer is simple. And it goes back to the one immutable law of business growth that we talked about early on, the, the philosophy that kind of undergirds the entire conversion funnel model. And that's this, that he or she who is able and willing to spend the most to acquire a customer wins. And when you have the greatest margin, when you have more profit than anyone else in your space, when your profit margin is higher than all of your other competitors, you're able to do just that. You could spend a whole lot more to acquire customers and still net out, still make the same money. In many cases, make more. So if we can double the leads and still maintain the quality and double the number of customers, and then all of these high paying ecstatic customers, you now are able to double the margin through some profit maximizers, through some speed and automation upsells, things like that. Our growth potential is now up to eight. Now, obviously, we're still not done. We've got one more variable to optimize, and that's exactly what we're going to get at uh, in the next module. But for now, let's get this M up. How can we increase your profit margin? Give it some thought, come up with some ideas, and, and really write down a plan of action before you move on. Because out of all of them, this one has the greatest potential to make the most immediate impact in your business.